What is your experience with systems engineering and what drew you to this field? I have been working in systems engineering for the past 10 years, and I was drawn to the field because I enjoy solving complex problems and working with cutting-edge technology. How do you approach problem solving in a systems engineering context? I approach problem solving by breaking down complex issues into smaller, more manageable pieces, and then applying a systematic approach to finding a solution. What is your understanding of systems thinking and how do you apply it in your work? Systems thinking is a holistic approach to problem solving that considers the interconnectedness of different elements. I apply this approach in my work by considering the impact of changes on the entire system, not just individual components. How do you ensure that requirements are met in the systems engineering process? I ensure that requirements are met by maintaining clear communication with stakeholders throughout the project and by continuously testing and validating the system to ensure that it meets the specified requirements. What are some of the challenges you have faced when working on complex systems engineering projects? Some of the challenges I have faced include managing competing priorities, dealing with technical complexities, and working with cross-functional teams with different perspectives and priorities. How do you manage risks and uncertainties in the systems engineering process? I manage risks and uncertainties by identifying potential issues early on and by developing contingency plans to mitigate them. I also regularly review and update risk management plans throughout the project life cycle. Can you describe your experience working with system architecture and design? I have extensive experience working with system architecture and design, including developing high-level system designs, creating detailed component specifications, and ensuring that the system design meets all relevant standards and regulations. How do you incorporate feedback from stakeholders into the systems engineering process? I incorporate feedback from stakeholders by actively soliciting input and feedback throughout the project lifecycle and by regularly reviewing and incorporating feedback into the system design and development process. Can you describe your experience with systems integration and testing? I have extensive experience with systems integration and testing, including developing test plans, executing system tests, and conducting root cause analysis to identify and resolve issues. What tools and methodologies do you use to manage requirements in systems engineering projects? I use a variety of tools and methodologies to manage requirements, including requirements management software, traceability matrices, and agile development methodologies such as Scrum. How do you ensure that systems engineering projects are delivered on time and within budget? I prioritize tasks and set realistic timelines constantly monitor progress, and adjust plans as needed to stay on schedule and within budget. Can you describe your experience with configuration management in systems engineering? I have experience implementing version control systems, maintaining configuration baselines, and ensuring consistency across all system components. How do you ensure that systems engineering projects are aligned with business objectives? I collaborate with stakeholders to understand their needs and goals, and develop a systems engineering plan that addresses those objectives. How do you stay up to date with emerging technologies and industry trends in systems engineering? I attend industry conferences, read relevant publications, and participate in professional networks to stay informed about the latest developments in the field. Can you describe your experience working with cross-functional teams? I have worked with teams from diverse backgrounds and departments, and have experienced communicating effectively and collaborating to achieve common goals. How do you prioritize and manage competing demands in a systems engineering project? I assess each demand's impact on the project's objectives, prioritize tasks accordingly, and communicate with stakeholders to manage expectations and adjust timelines as necessary. What is your experience with risk management in systems engineering? 
I have experience identifying and assessing risks, developing risk mitigation strategies, and monitoring risks throughout the project lifecycle to minimize their impact on project success. How do you measure the success of a systems engineering project? I evaluate project outcomes against established goals and metrics, and collect feedback from stakeholders to identify areas for improvement in future projects. Can you describe your experience with system verification and validation? I have experience developing and executing test plans to verify and validate system functionality and performance, ensuring that they meet the specified requirements and standards. How do you approach system maintenance and support? I believe in proactive maintenance to prevent issues before they occur. I also prioritize prompt and effective troubleshooting to minimize downtime and ensure reliable system operation. What is your experience with software engineering in a systems engineering context? I have worked extensively with software engineering in systems engineering projects, including designing and developing software to integrate with hardware and systems, testing and validating software, and debugging issues. How do you ensure that systems engineering projects are compliant with industry standards and regulations? I stay up to date with industry standards and regulations and incorporate them into the system design and development process. I also work closely with regulatory agencies to ensure compliance and obtain necessary certifications. Can you describe your experience with project management in a systems engineering context? I have experience leading cross-functional teams in complex systems engineering projects, managing timelines, budgets, and resources to deliver high-quality results on time and within budget. What is your experience with cybersecurity in a systems engineering context? I have experience implementing cybersecurity measures in systems engineering projects, including conducting risk assessments, developing security plans, and implementing security controls to protect against cyber threats. How do you approach system documentation and knowledge management? I believe in thorough documentation throughout the entire system development lifecycle to ensure that stakeholders have access to accurate and up-to-date information. I also prioritize a knowledge transfer to ensure that team members have the necessary skills and knowledge to maintain and support the system. Why is it worth subscribing to our YouTube channel? By subscribing to our YouTube channel, you will have access to a wealth of knowledge and insights about automation testing from industry experts, which can help you stay ahead of the curve in your career.